Hello everyone, hope you're doing good. In this video, I'm going to share one of the most easiest way to download Windows 11 officially from Microsoft website. I have seen people going to Windows Insider program unable to download the ISO. I'll tell you step by step to download the ISO file and install Windows 11 on your computer. No matter it has TPM or the requirements, if it's there or not, you will be able to install Windows 11 in your computer. So let's get started. I'll open a website and this website will be there in the description as well. Before jumping into that, I would recommend to watch the whole video. The link will look like this, the Microsoft.com website. And here you need to click on Windows Insider Preview. The moment you click on that, you won't find Windows 11 here you need to click on Windows 10 Insider Preview. So once you click on that Windows 10 Insider Preview and scroll it down to the bottom and here, we, and here you will find Select Edition. So once I'll click on that, you will get so many options of Windows 11. Windows 11 Insider Preview Dev Channel, Windows 11 Insider Preview Beta Channel, the difference between beta and dev channel. This Windows 11 ISO will have more features. However, it will be, if you compare with beta, it will be less stable. And if I compare, if I talk about beta, it is more stable. And compared to dev channel, it has less feature. So since I always take the risk, I'll go with Windows 11 Insider Preview dev channel. You can select the beta one, it's up to you. And once you select that, you just need to click on confirm and you will get the window like this. Select the product language. So you need to click on choose one and there are a list of available languages. Czech, Danish, Dutch, English, English, UK, French, German. So I'll select English and I'll click on confirm. Now it's validating my request. Now it's asking to download the 64-bit. Now we have got an option to download 64-bit. So this is a ISO file. You just have to click on that and the file will be the size of 5.1 gigabytes. So if I click on show all, total size of Windows 11 is 5.1 GB. So make sure you have enough space and let the ISO download. Once the ISO file is installed, you can do a parallel installation of Windows 11 by doing just double click on that ISO and install it. And the second way is to create a USB bootable drive with the help of Rufus. And if this video is helpful for you, please hit the like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next video.